hi everyone welcome back to my channel and if you're new here welcome today i'll be taking you to a rodeo and giving you some big news so you don't want to miss this vlog for sure don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you already haven't done so and if you have thank you so much i'm sure all of you guys are wondering where have i been um so i will tell you in my previous vlog i did tell you guys that i'm gonna have big news for you guys in my next vlog so i'm gonna give you guys that big news uh we just bought a house i know all of you are saying congratulations so thank you so much uh definitely definitely i will be giving you guys a house tour but i'm just unpacking and we're busy uh setting up the house so as soon as that's done of course i'm gonna give you guys a house tour um so i'm super excited about that so much has been going on this summer it's been so busy it's been so hectic you guys know that there was a wedding in the family so as soon as that finished then we um, did the house <laughs> so we're moving into the house and then also during that time my son had his wisdom teeth pulled so it, it was so much going on this summer it's been a super busy summer super hectic I do have my hat on but everybody is telling me that it doesn't look western enough that it actually looks like I'm going to Coachella so be it um I think it looks cute so this is what I'm wearing to the rodeo okay like I told you guys this summer has been super busy it's been super hectic but I have a little bit of free time today and that's why I'm going to this rodeo um I've never been to a rodeo before so this is definitely my first rodeo no pun intended intended so i'm really looking forward to it i'll definitely be sharing it with you guys so stay tuned it's going to take approximately an hour to get there so it's a little bit of a drive but as soon as i get there i'll start recording for you guys and my hat is starting to look like a pirate's hat kind of <laughs> we just parked and you guys can see there's a carnival going on right over here and the rodeo is there so we're going to go inside right now Ladies and gentlemen, tonight you'll be seeing two main events, the two crowd favorites whenever you go to a rodeo. Cowboys bull riding competition, followed by the ladies barrel racing. But next we'd like to talk about the main event, the bull riding. Guys, as always, we have front row seats. This is my seats right here. Look at that. I left my purse on there. And the rodeo is going to take place right over there. So of course, front row seats always. <laughs> This is the best view. They have all the horses over here. And then the rodeo is going to happen right over here. So as soon as it starts, of course, I'm going to show you guys. Super, super hot out here. But at least I have a hat to protect. You can see all the horses are on this side over here. I'm out here tonight, but the action is just about to heat up right here inside of the arena. And right now, it is time to meet the top bull riders in tonight's performance. And again, the world was rocked. In 2003, the American Rodeo Breed began its very own registry. They became a nationally recognized breed the same year. In one decade, they went from 200 or 20,000 animals to over 180,000. Nowadays, it's standard to pair the best cows to the best bulls each and every year to produce the very best calves every time. The average payout for a competing bull has went from topping out at $20,000 to up to this bull has been three times to the PBR World Finals. He has a lifetime earnings of $39,000. As is in a yearling class, he was number six in the world. Would you say hey to bull EG7095 above and beyond? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands. One nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Fallowville, Michigan. I believe one of the many things that makes America the greatest country in the world is a little piece of paper that hangs in a museum in Washington, D.C. It is the United States Constitution. Voters 
It is known as our national anthem. So proudly we hail at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er the ramparts we watched were soon gallant. Again, I got one question I want to ask each and every one of you. And when you all answer this question, I want you to make more noise than you're going to make the entire weekend long. The question is, remember I want to hear from you good and loud, is ladies and gentlemen, are you ready to rodeo? Make some noise for the Team did take a shot. No. Oh, he about got ran over by 
the Swagger Wagon twice. Down at Cowboy. Let's do it. Whoa. So let me just say this. In no other sport will you see somebody say, hey, your life's in danger. Here I go into the fire with you. You need to make a lot more noise for your bullfighters. Look at this. I'm gonna pick one up. Look at all this. They're piping hot, so I can't really bite into one right now. Look at that. Yeah. That's right. Oh, there you go. They smell amazing. Look at these fried Oreos. I think we're going crazy with the food. Look at the funnel cake. They had several barns there that housed the winning animals. Yes, these animals all have won a ribbon. 
Uh, they had goats, they had pigs, they had horses. So all of these animals that you see here have won a ribbon at the fair. And there was one particular goat that we saw right over here. It was so friendly. It was letting us pet it and everything. It was so cute. It kept com uh, coming out for us to pet it. Look at it. How adorable is this goat? Most of these animals you could pet, but there were some of them, mostly um, in the horse barn I'll show you later on. Uh, they had signs up that that animal bites, so you don't want to pet it. But most of these animals you could go ahead and pet. And I absolutely love these lights in the barn. Uh, they lit up the night. It was so beautiful. And now I'm going to take you over to the barn that had the horses in it. The first horse right here is a miniature horse. It was so tiny and it was so cute. Uh, this was uh, later on during the night. So all of these horses were quite tired. They had their name tags up on there. So you could see what the name of the horse is. But again, there were some that did bite. So you couldn't pet all of them. But most of them you could go ahead and pet. Look at the gorgeous moon. And... There's the carnival. The parking lot is all empty now. Heading home. I tried to film fireflies for you guys, but unfortunately um, I couldn't do it. They go too fast. I hope all of you guys enjoyed this rodeo and the carnival with me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you already haven't done so. And if you have, thank you so much. Remember, always believe in yourself, love yourself, and take care of yourself. Until next time from the rodeo carnival. Bye guys.